I'm here at the new Wawa in beautiful Fairless Hills, Pennsylvania, because I heard they got beer. That's right, a Wawa that sells beer and pineapple drinks. So let's see what all the fuss and the huss and the bus is about, and what kind of beer do they actually got here. But look at this, it's Hoagie Fest. Peace, love, and hoagies. How groovy is that? I like the retro 70s look and the imagery, but we're mostly here to check out the beer section. And here is the takeout hours, open until 2 a.m. Fantastic. Unlike the locals, Trenton Road Takeout and Puss in Boots, since the virus, they decided to close at 10 p.m. Wawa says, you want your beer at 2 a.m., we got you covered. And they got some IPA, some planet-looking beer. A truly drink that packs a little punch, if you know what I mean. 12-pack for $20. And we got some White Claw for all you kitty cats. The Classic for $20.50. Variety Pack for $21. So I reckon that's uh, probably about 3 bucks cheaper than your local takeout. Corona, $18 for the 12-pack bottles. That looks pretty good, too. They got the Heine Sixers. Some Bud Light cans. Michelob Ultra cans. And look at this beautiful sitting area. Reminds me of McDonald's in the 1980s. Where's Grimace and the Hamburglar when you need them? So we got some more. Oh, look at this. Samuel Adams, our second president, has his own beer. We got some Fisherman beer. We got some Alien beer. Nice variety there, guys. And we got the Bud Light Lime six packs. $9. That's pretty good. Trent Road Takeout, 1940 for a 12-pack. So it's actually cheaper by the six here. And we got the Budweiser Upside Down beer. 15-pack cans for $13. Less than a dollar a can. Same with the Miller Lite 15 packs. We got the Upside Down Bush Light cans. Look at that. 15 for 11 bucks. The Natty Daddy. Who's your daddy? And classic Natty Light. $11, $10. Wow. Wawa's bringing it back 90s pricing. I love it. And let's check out the beer cooler. Because as you know, it is a little better when your beer is cooler. So let's check out the cans they got. The White Claw, $4 a can. And we got some Bud Light Seltzer, $4 a can. So that seems priced a little higher in my opinion. We got some Arnold Palmer beer. Does that make you golf better? Anybody know? I don't golf. Twisted Tea, so we got some Four Loco, we got the Heineken bottles, the Smirnoff Ice bottles, lots of different can varieties, that's pretty good, but what about the Bud Light Lime 25 ounces, Three fifty. so that's actually about a dollar more expensive than Trenton Road Takeout, so it looks like the cans are about 35% more expensive but the 6 and the 12 packs are definitely looking good. So I guess pick your poison. You want a quick can, you spend a dollar, dollar fifty more. If you're going to do it long term with a 6 or 12 pack, you save a few bucks. But again, I like this. So convenient, so many options. Open till 2 a.m. Budweiser 12 pack bottles. How much is that? $13. So pretty much a dollar a bottle or dollar ten a bottle. Some flat tire beer, maybe get a flat tire, go to Wawa, get it fixed, and you just drink a flat tire beer. And we got some Miller Lite cans and Miller Lite bottles. That's pretty good variety, guys. What you thinking? You liking what you seeing? And we got the nice, beautiful seating area. Maybe you could do some fantasy football with your buddies. This is like, it has its own mini bar in the corner of Wawa. How convenient. So I am really impressed, guys. Uh, I think this guy looks impressed. He's looking around as well. So let me know in the comments what you think.